Today's Daily Dose of Math is about using these four symbols to fill in the blank spaces in all of these statements. As a reminder, this means is an element of, this means is not an element of, this means is a subset of, and this means is not a subset of. And also as a reminder, I have my chalkboard showing what natural numbers are, what integers are, and what real numbers are. Let's start with this first statement. Is 4 an element or a subset of natural numbers? What I want to focus on is how we realize which of these symbols we don't need, which symbol we need. 4 is not a set. If it was a set, it would look like this. It would be written in notation that shows there is a set that contains 4. So 4 is not a subset of natural numbers because it's not a set. Therefore, I'm not using either of these two symbols. And yes, 4 is an element of natural numbers. It shows that here, although the 4 is not showing, the dot 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 implies that 4 is a natural number. So I'm using this symbol is an element of. Negative 1 is not a set, so I'm using one of these two symbols. And negative numbers are not part of natural numbers. So negative 1 is not an element of natural numbers. 1 half is a fraction. There are no fractions in natural numbers. So 1 half is also not an element of natural numbers. 0.7, these decimals in between whole numbers are not part of natural numbers. So 0 0.7 is not an element of natural numbers. And I know that I don't need these symbols because none of these is presented as a set. But now we have this, which is the set that has only one element, which is four. Four is an element of this set. Is the set that includes four a subset of natural numbers? Yes, it is. I'm using this. Because it's a set, I want to use one of these symbols. The set that includes negative one, is it a subset of natural numbers? No, because its element negative one is not a natural number. So in this case, I need this symbol, is not a subset of. Now we get to a bunch of statements where what's on the left isn't looking like an element, it's a set. So is the set of natural numbers, a subset of real numbers? Yes, it is. All the natural numbers are included in the bigger set of real numbers, which is all numbers. So natural numbers is a subset of real numbers. Natural numbers in a very similar way is a subset of integers because all of these natural numbers are included in the set of integers. So now I'm seeing situations where I want to use these two symbols because what I see on the left is a set. Is integers a subset of natural numbers? No. So I'm using this symbol. Is real numbers a subset of natural numbers? No. Both integers and real numbers are much bigger sets than natural numbers. They include lots of elements that are not in natural numbers. So neither is a subset of natural numbers. And then we get to this last one, which is a bit of a trick question. Is this a subset of natural numbers? The answer is no. But this is a set. This is the set that has only one element, and that element is this special R symbol. The set containing the R symbol is not a subset of natural numbers because the R symbol is not a natural number. I hope this helps the students who need to use these symbols to be able to narrow down when they use these two symbols, when they use those two symbols, and which is the correct symbol to choose in each case. That is today's Daily Dose of Math. Please remember to like, subscribe, and share.